Welcome back to the Accessible Art History YouTube channel. For this week's episode, we are going to be examining a masterpiece of Mannerist art. This period bridges the gap between the Renaissance and Baroque eras. Our focus for this video will be on the Madonna with the Long Neck by Parmigiano. The Madonna with the Long Neck is one of the most famous paintings of the Mannerist period of art. It was created by the artist Parmigiano between 1535 and 1540. This work features the Virgin Mary holding her son, Jesus Christ. She is dressed in regal robes, including a blue one that indicates her identity. On her right, a group of six angels look adoringly on at the young Jesus. Behind the group, there is a large column and St. Jerome. This work was originally intended for a chapel, but Parmigiano died before it could be finished. Eventually, the Grand Duke of Tuscany purchased it in 1698. In 1948, the Uffizi Gallery received it, which is where the painting hangs today. The most startling, almost jarring aspect of this painting is the Madonna's appearance. Parmigiano was known for exaggerating certain features of the central figures of his art. Mary is almost twice the size of the angels next to her. Her neck is long and graceful, meant to resemble that of a swan. Jesus is clearly too big to be an infant, but he is also elongated to draw attention to him. It gives the scene an ethereal, otherworldly quality, which plays well into the divine subject. The Madonna with the Long Neck is one of the most famous pieces of Mannerist art. Although it depicts the traditional subject of the Virgin Mary and Infant Jesus, there are unusual details in their depictions. However, it is still beautiful in its own way. <laughs> 